Alright, so, I'm back. Finally have a new mic. Hopefully it's good. People have told me that it's pretty good, but we'll find out here. Anyway, using this golden cuckoo to get back into the sacred grove, which I hate. Just one big stupid maze. Real annoying. And if you've already used that Howl Stone before, don't bother. You really don't need to use it again, because you can't. Now, once you enter this forest, the Skull Kid will appear. Again. He'll summon his little minion guys. Again. I believe they're called golems, but... Uh... You'll basically have to chase them around the place. Again. But this time, there is a little help. And you notice, you may notice when you walk through the door things that there's a little orange glow on the other side. If you see that, that means you're heading in the right direction. You'll see an example in a few seconds. See that orange glow? That tells you you're going the right way, so follow it. And sometimes the Skull Kid may be out of reach, so you'll have to use your bow and arrow. So make sure that's handy. <laughs> and of course, make sure you ignore those guys unless they're really getting in your way. There's really no point in finding them constantly, because you'll be doing it quite often if you do. Alright, here he is. You need to hit him with the bow and arrow this time. And you need to be fast if those guys are tailing you. I think you only have to hit him two more times. Maybe three. I'm not entire entirely sure. Maybe one. I, I honestly don't remember. Yeah, it seems there was no orange glow in any of the caves this time, so I got kind of lost. Yay. Post all if you want it. I really am not going to bother. I don't know if I've said it before, but I'm not getting all the heart pieces, post souls, etc, etc. That'll take far too long. Basically, at this point, you just have to guess the correct path. Well, it seems I found it somewhat okay. It took a few minutes, a couple, one. But, yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
This is the room he's in. About time to. fight is ridiculously, ridiculously easy, excuse me. Just him with it, your bow three times. It's really simple, just watch. You don't even have to pay attention to his minions. As you can see, you could easily get a shot in before they get to you, so... Don't even bother with them. Same with this. You can get a shot in before they get to you, so... Go ahead and shoot them. Don't bother with them. And for the third time, same rules apply. You can shoot them before they get to you. So shoot them. And it's over. What a pathetic little boss, or mini-boss, or whatever, I don't know what it is. So you'll want to push that block that's right next to Link to create a shortcut of sorts. And you mi might find that this place is familiar. If you don't remember it, then all I can say is wow. It's the place where you got the Master Sword earlier. Might have thought there was nothing there once you left, but there is one more thing. What you want to do is go back to the area where you picked up the Master Sword, and you want to, like, re... Uh, I don't know what to say, uh, basically stab the pedestal that you got the sword from. Th that will open up the next temple already. Yeah, I know. That's pretty fast. back to that door. 